So hey folks, um, uh, this video today is all about the, uh, the 30 litre rucksack that I've got on my back right now. Um, so I've come out trying to find some rain, which is uh, not like me really. Uh, I'm normally seeking the good weather. And uh, basically I've come out to test the 30 litre dry bag rucksack from Lomo that they've kindly sent me. With winter coming on, the, uh, the rucksack that I was using, now that I've turned the bike into a more of a naked bike and not got my uh, top box on anymore, uh, I wanted something that was totally waterproof. The Lomo one seems to fit the bill, so uh, currently testing it. See how it is, uh, in search of some uh, rainy weather and uh, it won't be long before I find that in the UK. So I'll put some shots of the, uh, the rucksack now as it's seated on my back. Um, it's really comfy, lots of space in it. As I said, it's 30 litres and it's got uh, welded seams so it's totally waterproof inside and also there's a uh, outer um, zipped pocket which is kind of semi-waterproof so it, uh, it's good for things that I'm not too bothered about if they get wet or not. But the inside is totally dry. So I'm going to switch to uh, uh, unboxing now and uh, talk a little bit more about the rucksack and uh, you can see it more in full just now. So hey folks and uh, welcome to another uh, package opening and uh, this product uh, we're going to have a look at now and also I'm going to do a further video to review the product uh, once I've tested it and used it for about uh, a few weeks and uh, come back with a report on that also. So um, yeah, so this product's been sent to me by a company called Lomo, uh, they're a UK company and basically they make uh, a lot of waterproof roll top bags, rucksacks, uh, they make a lot of uh, products for kayaking, canoeing, uh, wetsuits, uh, all that kind of stuff that uh, is around water basically so um, so a lot of their products have uh, welded seams including the uh, the rucksack that they've sent me um, so we're gonna have a look at that and uh, get into it um, now normally um, I, I like rucksacks on motorcycles as well as uh, roll top dry bags when I'm touring and I prefer to use those uh, when I'm uh, out on the bike and doing big tours and things like that over side panniers um, so we will come back later in the series with uh, a look at their uh, roll top bags um, for use with touring and weekend trips and things. Uh, but for today, let's get into uh, the video. So uh, let's open the, uh, the package. And uh, already I see that it's a, uh, a white uh, rope sack. So it's, uh, it's good for uh, being seen visibility wise. And uh, this is from the company, as I say, Lomo. Um, I've heard very good things about these rucksacks. And the main reason is they're totally waterproof. So if you are using the, uh, the bike that you've got for commuting, um, you can also put your laptop and all your things you want to keep dry. And uh, peace of mind, really, that they're all uh, perfectly dry inside if you get caught in a rainstorm. Um, so that's the outer pocket. It's a 30 litre um, pack and uh, also on the back side uh, you can see here that you've got uh, shoulder straps uh, you've got a waist strap and also a chest strap to uh, to connect to um, what i'm going to do is i'm going to actually uh, fill the rucksack and come back to you so you can see the actual sack um, with uh, with stuff in it so once we've got our stuff in our backpack that we want uh, basically all you do is you uh, push down on the top to get the air out you turn the top over one two three times and then uh, basically on this side here you've got some straps click on and you can uh, pull those down one thing i do like it's got these little uh, little loops here so it keeps all the straps neat and not flapping around in the wind and um, we'll just do the other side find it Again, I can pull the loop down to stop the strap flapping about in the wind. So you see that just there. Those are the straps that uh, tie it down. So on the front, 
or the back, you've got the, uh, the zip for your outer pocket. You can put things like uh, wet gloves, um, your lunch, your Mars bar, your bottle of water, whatever you want in there. And then uh, knowing that everything within the pack is uh, totally waterproof. Um, on the top, uh, don't know if you can see, just here, you've got the, uh, the carry handle strap, so you can pick it up and carry it around like this. So, let's have a look at it uh, on my back and uh, see how it fits. So you've got a chest strap just here, a waist strap just here, and then you've got uh, plenty of room to adjust the thing up. And as you can see, uh, it's just on my back. Totally waterproof, totally comfy actually. So the padding is really nice and it doesn't sit low on your back. So that's a look at the, uh, the new roll top uh, rucksack from Lomo. Um, also, by the way, this is also featured uh, by MCN as being Best Buy. And uh, what we'll do is we'll check this out on the, uh, the next couple of weeks. And uh, the UK weather is pretty rainy at the moment. So we'll give it a good test and I'll give you a full report on what I think about it uh, in another video coming up shortly. Okay, so one thing I can say about this uh, Lomo rucksack is that uh, it's really comfortable and uh, initially I felt it on my back but uh, I've been on the bike now about half an hour and uh, I kind of can't feel the weight of it anymore uh, so I've got it fully loaded up with the laptop, a few clothes and things just to fill it out and uh, get it up to its maximum capacity or thereabouts. Yeah, I really can't feel the weight on my back. The shoulder straps are really comfy, the chest strap, can't really feel it. So, uh, in my book, that's a winner. So I just need to uh, get some rain now and uh, test the waterproof uh, functionality. I'm sure it's 100% waterproof, but uh, yeah, I'm heading towards the rain clouds. So what I will do, I will uh, test it for a couple of weeks now in the uh, horrible English weather and then I'll give you a uh, short update video in a couple of weeks time on uh, my thoughts. Yeah, we'll catch you on another one.